it's really not as light as it looks and that sunrise is really much prettier than the picture shows but this is way better than we've had in the last week it's not foggy there's a little bit of ground fog out in a couple of the pastures but it is not foggy it is that day of the year the one marked aside to remember those who have served our country I would like to say thank you I did not actually serve our country in the military. I was, uh, if they hadn't shut the draft off when they did, in, what was it, 84 or 85, I would have been in the next group. I was 40 numbers from being called. At the time, instead of serving my country, I was a volunteer firefighter. The station is one mile from us. So, you know what I did. One of the busiest volunteer fire departments in the state. We averaged, I think it was 400 calls a year. Sometimes it was a little more than that. But anyway, that is the route I took and did that for 20 years at two different departments. Stuck around here and busted my butt off farming. So, thank you veterans for your service. Those who have come home and those who have not. And thank you to their families. That's about all I got for today. Well, at least for now. I got some stuff I need to put together, but I'm not sure how much of it I'm going to use. That has nothing to do with this. This is strictly a thank you and a reminder to everybody it is Veterans Day. If you see a veteran, thank them. Thanks for watching.